going to hit my shot here. Then I'm going to walk to the green and tell you about it. Hang on. There you look at that. Right at it. Fast. A little thin, but. Where's your pace at, Rip? Hello, folks, and welcome to The Legacy. I'm your host, Doc Walker. Each week, we take a little of the old school combined with the new with one thing in mind, and that is to win. And we are privileged this week to have as our guest, Super Bowl champion and MVP, my buddy, Mark Rippin. Ripper, how you doing? And a fellow pac or to boot, right? That's right, baby. Pac-8, Pac-10, Pac-12. You call it, baby. The Conference of Champions. Rip, I know your passion for the game of golf, and that's where you are. Thanks for allowing us to jump into, oh my goodness, look at that. And I guarantee you, you're about 375 yards down the fairway somewhere. Rip, I want to start with your unusual journey. Of course, being Canadian and American, one guy that has a distinction, a guy that understands what the Great Cup is all about and the Super Bowl Lombardi Trophy, two years. You were inactive. And Joe Gibbs, I call it his layaway plan. <laughs> that. And what was it like being in that in that uh, incubator, if you will? These guys, they're coming in to win yesterday, and uh, it's a different it's a different format, a different um, ideals that the NFL has, and they want guys to come in there and perform and get it done yesterday. And you know as as well as anyone when we played. The expectations were playoffs, deep into the playoffs, and Super Bowls. Yeah. Gosh forbid. I mean, seven and nine were in the playoffs. That's great. I mean, it's been 29 years since we've had a team that's won 11 games. 29 years, Doc. 1991 Mm -hmm. was the last uh, Washington football team to win 11 games during a regular season. And so I think the, the formula that Ron has now and what they're doing uh, I think is going to be great. It's going to bode well for the future. Got a lot of great young players. Um, Alex is a, is, you know, what a, what a story that is, you know, for him to just to play football. And so it's it's pretty unique and pretty awesome to see this team get there. Uh, obviously, the NFC East was struggled this year, but hey, it's hard to win in the NFL. You know, you understand that. Rip, your story is so unique. A guy like Jerry Rome, um, talking about some of the people that people don't realize that were behind the scenes because it needed a lot. First of all, you're tough as nails. And mentally, I mean, you're a giant. Because not only did were you battling with that, you also had to deal with the loss of, of a son, Drew. I mean, I mean that alone. I mean, I'm, I'm so, I, I get touched when we talk about Alex and I think about, well, wait a minute, Rip went through this thing. <laughs> we had to torn his heart up. You had to take a year out of football, but yet you bounced back. Well, what happens, uh, Doc, is first of all, you're fortunate for the people who are surrounded by, um, you know, my teammates, obviously. <laughs> you know, I mean, that speaks for itself. But uh, Jerry Rome to work with me in the um, during the year, weeks of, of practice and up to the games to take the time to go with me on the other field and run a two-minute drill, run routes, and with those rubber gloves he used to come out there with. I, 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 I owe the world to, you know, the Jerry Romes of this world and, and uh, you know, the guys that you look back on and think, wow, they are such a big impact of how how successful we were. The Reggie Branches, the Terry Orrs, the Clarence Verdans, you know, the guys that uh, – just kind of an epitome and it's that middle class now that you don't see very much you see a lower the guys that are coming at entry level and then the superstars you know that middle class was such a big thing for us and it um it really was one of the things that joe gibbs encouraged and you know in, in, engaged in was that uh, uh the guys that were you know backup linebackers backup tight ends uh special teams guys it was a really a unique blend and and, the, and then they had to have the guys perform, you know, the skill players perform. Your, your guys rushing the pass rusher, you know, the Charles Manns, the Dexter Manleys, and, and the Timmy Johnsons, you know, in the middle. And, and uh, you know, and then, then our linebacking core, you, you played with Oki and, and uh, you know, Kurt Gavea and Monty Coleman. Yeah. And um, I mean, you name it. These guys were 
essential cores to our team that um, made us what we were. And, and we had an owner that liked, liked keeping those guys around and a coach in Joe Gibbs that said, hey, they might have been a little long in the tooth, but they're great in the locker room. And they they developed a, We developed a, uh, a real team atmosphere. And that's what I think Ron Rivera is doing now and, and what this team is up to. You know, Rip, I'll say it, uh, and a kid, as an alum of the 83 team, I think the 91 team's the best team we've ever put on the field. How in the world did you manage the personalities of the posse? <laughs> well, two of the three were just kind of like, okay, hey, you know, what do I got to do? And then the, the third is probably the, the most uh, outspoken and vocal, but <laughs> he was 99.9% .9 right. You know, so you had to listen to them as, as much as you did encourage uh, um, the others. Because, you know, when you only have one football and three guys do amazing things, um, it's pretty unique to have a situation like that. But I think the one thing that we were successful and made us so good is we had we had a, uh, a great running game. And anytime you bring safeties up and in the box, you're going to you get and you have big play playmakers. You're going to make some big plays. And, and I, you know, I mean, that one year, I don't think I was touched maybe I was touched a lot, but I was only sacked seven times, you know, and, and we had blitz breakoffs, and hot reads and a lot of things that encompassed uh, us to achieve the things that we achieved and great, fun, smart guys. And I think when you put that chemistry in, it's a it's a formula for success. The Legacy is brought to you by Jana King. Let Jana King get your business back to business. Visit to schedule a disinfecting service today. Don't let the comfort fool you. Don't let the attention to detail lead you to believe that a Honda is a delicate machine. <laughs> You'd be wrong. Underneath every surface that carries a Honda badge, there has always been the capacity to amaze. From the core of everything we have ever built, all the way to the top of where you want to go. Rise to the challenge with the rugged performance of the Honda Pilot, Passport, and Ridgeline. Free health care, hundreds to more than $1,000 per month in disability compensation and tens of thousands for college tuition. These are just some of the U.S. Department of Veterans Affairs benefits that may be available to veterans. VA is focused on customer service like never before. Choose VA and see why veterans trust in VA reached an all-time high. Claim the benefits you've earned at choose.va.gov. Scratch-offs! They're insane! Wait! What? Dude, a hundred million in instant cash! Tons of hundred thousand dollar top prizes! Awesome! Let me see those! Oh, man! Hold on, I'll go get them! Take it to the extreme. Play new extreme scratch-offs from the Maryland Lottery and play safely and responsibly. D.C. has a home for the greatest hits of all time. That would be Michael Jackson for me. D.C.'s greatest hits. Madonna. Billy Idol. Live here. Cindy Lauper. Bon Jovi. 94.7. Blondie. The Eagles. The Drive. You earned that nickname, the Mad Bomber. Rip, I mean, very few have ever done it better, man. What made that? How did you get that magic touch? Great. Uh, great timing. You know, guys on guys on the same page obviously having uh you're only good you're only as good as the guys up front doc and to have the the amount of protection timing and receiving core that we had and then being able to make amends with those things too you know hit those things when you have the chance i think was essential for us to be successful you got a lot of dink and dunkers now they call them game managers but not with the mad bomber you daryl LaMonica. i mean i always thought of you and daryl LaMonica. Did you, did you, did you, I mean, that's way ahead of your time, Rip. But who's the one guy that you possibly patted your game at? Well, I, hard to say, you know, I mean, uh, I'd have to say Plunkett was one of them because he's a tough guy, you know, yeah. and, and, um, and I think I just loved, uh, you know, watching him, gotten to know him over the years too. Yeah. Um, he was kind of a tough guy that, again, nothing against, nothing against myself or Doug or Jimmy, but 
we didn't have the greatest mobility, but with it, our offensive lineman knew where the pocket was, and it wasn't gonna, it wasn't going to change, you know. So they had that comfort, and I think that's uh, huge in 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 sports. And because when you start rolling out, doing things, when the pressure is coming from the outside, that's when bad things happen. The Hogs protected you like the CIA protects the president. What was that like, and what did you have to give those biggins as gifts? Those guys are, are are a gift from heaven, you know. I mean, the, the amount of effort that they put in and the work that they put in the off season, and not only that, they're smart guys. Um, I don't want to tell them that because you know that's just kidding. Yeah, I do. Wait, 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 hold on, Rip. Which one of them was smart? All of them. Every one of them passed. No, I know. The I know. I'm Start, just ball. Starting know. with Bozo, starting with Bozo, all the way down to to Jake and and uh, Jim Lachey and all those guys. Smart guys, smart football players understood what we needed to do and, and went out and got it, so. As you look at the NFL right now and these quarterbacks from a home to Big Ben or whatever, what is your take on it? Who do you like and why? Well, I, I think the the Patrick Mahomes, um, Lamar Jacksons, uh, the Tom Brady's the guys, Tom's just a, such a, a huge, uh, has been there before, understand what, what it takes, the Aaron Rodgers, guys that make plays when it matters, Russell Wilson's, you know, in the fourth quarter when you need them, those guys are there. So I think it's uh, just a matter of defenses. And you got to look at two of the, in my case, two of the best defenses, three of the best defenses in the NFL right now are our defense, the, uh, the LA, uh, Los Angeles Rams defense, and the Buffalo Bills defense. Take nothing away from the other teams, but they're at that level where they can chase down some of these quarterbacks that are, you know, make things happen that uh, when their first, second, third receiver aren't there, they can buy some time. I tell you what, man, being drafted sixth round, winning Super Bowl, being an MVP, I know you'll never have to buy a drink in the state of Washington or across the border. We thank you, my friend. Good luck on the links, and we'll do this again. I Let's guarantee. Do it again, Doc. Love it, buddy. Thank, thank you, you for man. having me on. Cheers. Kiss the family for me. That is. Super Bowl MVP Mark Rippin, who shares some time with us on the links. So, again, for Kyle and Stevie, the best in the business in bringing the legacy to you week in and week out. I am Doc Walker. We will sign off for this week, and we can't wait to get back here and bring you more of the best of the legacy. The Legacy is presented by your local Nissan dealers. Let's make a splash. Play the DC Lottery's Roaring Cash. Broken windshield, take one. Hey guys, my windshield just got broken. I feel like I need to blow off some steam. Let's go. Mr. Blanks, there's no need to be stressed. Geico makes it easy to file a claim online, on the app, or over the phone. Yeah, but what if I never hear back? That's going to make me want to go, jam, jam. No, your Geico claims team is always there for you. That makes me want to celebrate with some fireworks. Five, six, seven, go. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Geico, great service without all the drama. D.C. has a home for the greatest hits of all time. That would be Michael Jackson for me. D.C.'s greatest hits. Madonna. Billy Idol. Live here. Cindy Lauper. Bon Jovi. 94.7. Blondie. The Eagles. The Drive.